So, that's not good. Not at all. What happened? Uh, just regular practice stuff during the drill. You know, it gets physical, you know, things happen. <laughs> so, some just end up falling the wrong way, end up breaking my hand, but you know. Are you uh, able to still practice? Or yes, are you just... I'm still able to practice. Uh, the recovery is going to be quick, so I'm not even worried about it. So, you're not missing a beat? Not missing a beat at all. Well, that's a good thing. That's a great thing. Very yeah. Excited. How is it different playing with that? cast on it's just like you know you have one less hand and being on the d line it's a little more difficult but you know it's like you know it's working on my left more than my right you know work on pass rush more than run game okay are you strictly working dn still uh, i'm working dn and d tackle are you yeah between them which one do you like better um i'm still considering myself an end but you know they're packing on the weight on me, so you know, <laughs> so, you know we're mixing it in both end and end tackle. So when you came in in January, what did you weigh, and now what do you weigh? Uh, I came in at 245, and right now you're not I'm, 245. I'm pushing 270. Wow. 270 right now. And you're still quick as. Yup, yeah, just as fast, if not faster than me. Is it crazy to think that you put that much weight on and yeah, and I still keep your quickness? I didn't, and, I didn't think I was gonna put that on that much weight at all. Actually, I thought I was going to be like, you know, 250 at most, 255, 270 came out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> what, how did it help you coming in in January? Uh, learning the playbook, getting the system down, learning, meeting the coaches, the personalities, and the practice schedule, learning the grind before the season started. It was all just a great process. Um, who's kind of taking you under their wing? At all the other guys, we're just one big, one big group. So yeah. as soon as like me, me and Caden came in, all the older guys took us under their wings and showed us the ropes. It's been great. What's uh, different about fall camp besides living in a hotel? Is that all right living in a hotel? Yeah, living in a hotel is actually pretty cool, but yeah. really convenient with it being across the street. <laughs> yeah. So that's really nice. But uh, fall camp, it's just it's literally just a grind. It's different from spring ball and the amount of stuff that we have to do but the practices are still the same the competition level is still the same so in that aspect it's not much different but we just got a lot more stuff to do you kind of had a old journey in your recruiting process to, to get to Iowa how much how much did you learn in that my recruiting process is pretty crazy. Yeah. I learned a lot from it, but you know, in the end, I'm glad it's over. I'm glad where I'm at. So, yeah, good deal.